and welcome to Neophyte.tv, the technology show for the not-so-geeky. My name is Ben Friedman, and we are joined once again, as we always are when we're lucky, with the lovely and talented Shannon Wallace. Wow, thank you. Thank, thank you, you for being here. Quite the introduction. Well, it is our pleasure to have you Little here. soft shoe later. <laughs> yeah, we'll, do, we, we'll be here all week. Thank yeah. you very much. Try the shrimp. <laughs> but you know what? People don't know about you, but you are a, a singer, a performer. I am. Accomplished. I, Accomplished. I'm a, you don't have a website for that or something, do you? Um, I've got a sort of blog. Sort but of a blog yeah, thing? Yeah, I'm, I'm working on the website. All right, thing. not yeah. something you want to announce. No, no. So just it, Google her. To be, to be announced. <laughs> yes, just Google me. So uh, today we're going to be looking at a cool little product called Jella Skins. And they are these little things right here. Um, and what do we have? Um, what these are are protective plastic covers for your iPod, your iPhone, for your BlackBerry. These ones are for the iPhone because that's what I have, so that's what they sent me. Oh, he's bragging. Yes. Well, you could have an iPhone if you I, wanted. Well, then I'd have to switch providers. I don't want to do that. Well, you know, there's the big rumors coming out. Maybe you won't have to. Who uh, are you with? Uh, T-Mobile. T-Mobile. Uh, you know, you need to go with... I, I would... If they came out with the iPhone on Verizon, I might switch. But I wouldn't switch to go to T-Mobile. Yeah, I know, but I've been with T-Mobile since the late 90s. And so is that so, like loyalty? I mean, well, I'm, what have they yeah, done for you lately? Loyalty, no, but they do. They, you know? I'm paying very little money monthly. Well, so you should. For I mean, my, uh, it's a crap, I, crappy phone, or <laughs> crappy service. It's hey, just all around. inevitably we all get dropped. You know, no matter point, how right? little you pay for dirt, it's still oh, dirt. How about gel skins? How yeah. about jello skins? Let's get back Jell on skins. track. Jello skins. So... Uh, this one is uh, in the shape of a boombox <laughs> here, as you can see. And this is a motherboard. That is a motherboard. Yes. Very geeky. But they also have sports teams and art and what have you. Yes. And what's cool about them is they go on really easy. Now, okay. I don't know how many... Have you ever put a skin on your phone? No. No. I just have the skin on my bones. That's about all I've got. Wow. And how long does it take you to put uh, that on? Hours. 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 Uh, in the past, I've always found whenever you get these skins, you always get air bubbles or dust or stuff trapped under them. Yeah. It's really hard. These things go on like... Snap, it's awesome. I think it's part of this new 3M uh, control tack stuff that they use. So let me ask you this. Yeah. So when someone asks you, give me some skin, you know what that used to mean, right? So does that mean something different these days? Uh, I think it was some sort of a racist comment. No, wasn't give me some it? skin. Wasn't it a thing that black people five. used to say? No, or, give me five. Uh, give you five? That's giving me some skin. Give you some skin. That's giving me some skin. Okay, welcome back, Cotter. Uh, I don't know, that's before my time. Uh, anyway, it's different now, right? Because when someone says, give me some skin, now we're talking about jello skin. Exactly. So, uh, how does it go on your phone? Here is a phone, and you can see it covers the back. I, I, you can put it on the sides, although I don't have it on the sides, and it goes on the front as well. But here's the really cool part that blew Shannon away when uh, I showed her roll. earlier. Shall we do a drum roll? You also get a custom de uh, background. So, I don't know if you can see this, but you'll notice that the artwork continues all the way through the phone. It goes from the bottom all the way through the screen and through the top. It's the coolest thing it I've ever It is very seen. cool. So you have unity of background, uh, yeah. desktop. It's a very seamless, seamless flow. I love it. Yeah. Now, uh, <laughs> we're running along here. I'm going to speed up. No. So uh, they also make do, ones like for it. iPads and they can make custom ones. So here's a custom one. Look how nicely that's on there. It, you know, here less is more. Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely. I mean, yeah. it's just protecting it from scratches yeah, exactly. and all that sort of stuff. And it has the, the corporate name here of, like the, uh, of there. Yes. Um, and they'll do that for phones as well. So, for instance, here's one with our logo on it for the back and front of the phone. Now, who makes this? The company is called Jelliskins. Oh, so Jelliskins. Okay. com. And like I said, they have uh, sports stuff. And maybe I'll get Scott to put up a shot of their website here. And so, you can see they have like sportsy stuff and artsy stuff and custom stuff. Well, do they only do electronics, or does Jello Skins do cars as well? No, I, don't. I think it's mostly small devices, okay. but they have them for iPods. Like, if you have an iPod Nano, you can do right. that. Basically, anything you okay. want to protect with the layer of this uh, 3M stuff. I love it. Yeah. It's cool. It's cool. You're going to get one for your BlackBerry? I might. Yeah. And you could put your own. You could put your, your picture on there or a picture of your, your singing group or something. I like it. How much is it? Uh, you know, it starts at about 15 bucks. So this is $15? Yeah. I don't know. I, I mean, I like it. I think it's cool, but for 15 bucks? Really? You are hard to please. You know, Has anyone well, ever told you that? I think that's a nice way of you saying that I'm cheap. You're not cheap. You're just, you're just <laughs> you expect a lot. Well, I you do. You have high expectations. Well, I like think something special for nothing. Something for nothing. And so, uh, yeah, I mean, $15, I think 
what's worth fifteen dollars is your your own logo. Yeah, I think that was That's a little totally pricey. I don't, I don't remember. I think it was like nineteen or something. Oh, oh was it nineteen? Well, I can't remember. Well, still, even so, if it's under they twenty me a bucks, coupon, so I, I think didn't that's... actually. You know, we're reviewing it, so I didn't actually right. check out. They sent me a coupon to use it. But... Well, that would be interesting to know. Yeah. But for something that's just, you know, because you want it for fun, I would rather spend, put that $15 towards a pair of shoes. Now, it's not going to protect your phone from drops from a height or anything. It's not like a full on rubber case. Well, it's case. more really of a look, right? It's a look and it's scratch protection. It's going to stop, okay. especially a plastic phone like a Blackberry really needs that scratchy protection. But really, does it really matter not that on the back, you know, you're not getting a rise out of it? Does it really matter that this backside would scratch if you didn't have this protection? I don't know if you're going to scratch really your cares? backside, but it's <laughs> definitely something you want to avoid. I'd rather have other people scratch my backside. <laughs> okay. So. Well, with that, let's bring this segment to a close. Uh, that's the Jealous Skins case. I really like this artwork thing. I know Shannon does too. I think it's cool. Yeah. And again, you can get custom ones, different ones, and for different sort of devices too. Check them out. And we have another segment coming up in just a second, so please. Stay tuned. In today's fast-paced world, it's vitally important that young people develop a good understanding of how computers operate and how the internet works. LittleGeeks.org takes donated computers, refurbishes them, and then provides them to underprivileged kids at no charge. It's our goal at LittleGeeks.org to make sure that no kids are left out of the digital revolution. To find out how you can help, please visit www.littlegeeks.org. Thanks a lot. And we're back, and in the second segment today, we're looking at this, which looks a bit like a uh, disembodied laptop. A, um, a keyboard? It looks like a keyboard? It looks like a keyboard with this like it's white not, It's not piece a keyboard, it's, it looks like a keyboard. Well, it is a keyboard. Oh, okay. It, I mean, it looks like a keyboard, it is a keyboard. It looks like a laptop, but it isn't a laptop. What it is, is the Apple iPad keyboard. Now, a lot of people love the Apple iPad. I love the Apple. She loves the Apple iPad. I don't iPad. own one, but I we love it. We use it a lot, mm -hmm. but not everyone finds that little on-screen keyboard the easiest thing to type on. That's there true. it is. Have yeah. you ever tried typing on that? I one have, one? yes. Uh -huh. yeah. And it's not the easiest. It is not the easiest thing to type on, and, and uh, I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of bright, but uh, yeah, I, I should it. see if I can crank down the uh, brightness in here. There, is that better? A little better? A little bit, yeah, there okay. you go. There you go. So, uh, sorry about that. Uh, so, uh, yeah, so what you can do is you can take this and insert it thusly into the, uh, into the, this stand, and uh, now you can just type on it just like you would normally type it, right in here. And you've got volume controls. Amazing. And you've got, uh, you can go back to the main screen like so. I'm in can... love with this. Really? I'm absolutely in love with this. Really? Yes. Well, number one, I'm already in love with the, I, the iPad, and I'm not an owner yet. However, She's an I'm, iPad lover. I am an iPad lover. But this keyboard yeah. is amazing because it's relatively lightweight. It's very compact. Essentially, you have your whole entire computer into two pieces. It's completely transportable. Hmm. It can follow you know what I like about go. this I is it. that you can take it on an airplane, and it is the, if you look at the depth here, it's still... Yeah. What is this? This is like the depth of the, the unit. It's still, right. even overall, it's still such that you, even in coach. Right. What is can, that, like six, eight inch, inches yeah, maybe? Yeah, it's, the, it, you know, it's, still, um, yeah. it's still slender enough right. that you can use it in, in that sort of environment. Give that a type and see how it feels. Oh, you're not really typing. Come on. I can't. There's nothing on here. No. I've got to go to notes first. There you go. And then, and then. <laughs> this is the worst fake typing ever. <laughs> <laughs> wait. How do, wait. There, we, there you go, close enough. Can I hit enter yeah. and then return and then do a hard return? Okay. There you go. This is fantastic and Look at her go. Orgasmic. <laughs> wow. Seriously. That one did it spell <laughs> and orgasmic. It, only took, it yeah. only took $69. I mean, that's that's amazing. <laughs> $69. That's exactly how that's much this unit costs. That's an incredible price. It is. I would buy this for $69. I would not buy a skin for $15, but I'd buy this for the, so the skin 15 for earlier is that's too pricey, but this is beautiful. It is because it, you get it's it's all about what you get with your money. Right. And this this keyboard. Now it doesn't bother you at all that you know when the, if you have to take these two bits together. I mean, weight wise, you're almost up to a small laptop. I mean, you know. Yeah, but it's more compact. So if you were to take this off, you can put it this in your bag, and then this can go in your bag too, and it's something that's much more smaller in terms of actual size that it takes up. That's right. The one thing I don't like about this. Yeah. That. Your iPad has to go in the same direction. It can't. You can't put it in landscape. You mode can't there. put it in landscape mode and why because is it doesn't. That? It doesn't have a port. It doesn't have a port. There is no docking connector. There's no docking on connector. The it's just there's on the bottom. One. 
Somebody so, should make a little thing that uh, that like plugs in here and then like reroutes it down at the bottom. Either that or iPad makes a port down here and a You know, a lot of people there. have uh, speculated that on the next version of iPad that we'll have two. See, that's the thing about this whole thing about technology in general is that I am waiting to buy an iPad because it's too expensive right now for me to buy. Mm -hmm. But by the time I'd buy one, there's going to be a bigger and better one that comes that, out anyway. That's the way it always is. I know, and I hate that. So I mean, I'm waiting to get know. the coolest one I could possibly get. I think so it's going to be, it's, this one. one day it's going to be like cars, where you buy a model year. You're going to buy a 2010 iPad. Yeah. And then in September, the 2011 iPads will be out. But, True. you know, you think, well, I'm going to buy this iPad. It's going to be good for three years or four years. So you're yeah. not going to get the 2011, no, 12, 13. You're screwed either way. But let's talk about the back. Let's talk about keyboard. the back. That's what I like, too, about this. I'm going to okay. take this off so yeah. that it can be Hold it up for the, the good folks. Okay. So, it has a line out for your speakers. Yeah. I don't know if they can see that, which yeah. is very cool. Now, this is great if you're not so mobile. Like, let's say you take this places, and this stays at home on right. your desk. You could plug it into your speakers, mm -hmm. so that as soon as you come home, you drop this down, and hit iTunes, and away you go. It's perfect. And then this this goes in, and it... Um, and it charges up your iPad. That's right. So you, you just set it in there and it'll charge. So it's a, it's a char charging dock, docking Charging station. docking station. Now, it doesn't come with a charger. No. No, but the iPad does. So you yeah. plug that one in there and... It's, there you go. There you go. Or you can plug it into your laptop yeah. and it'll sync whenever you put it down there. So does this come in any sync. other colors? It does not. It's uh, apple white. That's apple it. white and yes. apple platinum? Apple white and apple aluminum. Is that platinum? It's aluminum. I don't know. The, well, I'm talking about like the colors. Platinum. The colors, I don't know. Like the color of copper, if you will. Color. Anyway, I like it. I'd it's buy it. It's the color it. of money, if you ask me. Sixty-nine dollars is a lot of. Is that too much for you? It's a lot of money for a keyboard. You wouldn't pay that, knowing that you do a lot of typing on. This I do iPad. do a lot of typing on there, and I must admit, in the week or two I've been using it, it is really nice, but it is still pricey. I don't know. Mm. I wish. You I'm know. surprised about that. For yeah, me. you know, I but I'd buy the skins. I like those Jell-O skins. Myself. Well, yeah. Well, I don't know. I like this. I think it's you get as big of a bang for your buck as you possibly could in the keyboard. Yes. Well, judging by your statement earlier, I think it's a bargain for you. I think you could have paid twice as much uh, for that. So You can't put a price on orgasm. And with that, <laughs> um, it's, uh, it's what do you think? Can you put a price on one? And if so, what would that price be? Go to our website and leave us a comment, www.neo-fight.tv. That's where you can go to leave us all those comments or go to our Facebook page, facebook.com slash neofights. That's where you can go to sign up. You have to like the page and that automatically puts you into our drawing where we give away some of the stuff we review. And if you happen to have an extra 30 seconds, take a look at this. If you need to make recordings of your computer screen, there's no better tool than Camtasia from TechSmith. In fact, you're watching a screen recording of this video right now. Camtasia can record your screen, your webcam, and high quality audio at the same time. It's perfect for training, presentations, podcasts, or any time you need to show what's going on on your computer. Camtasia is easy to use, but it's also extremely powerful. You can turn your screen recordings into high quality polished video in no time and share them with the world. And Camtasia is available for the Mac and PCs. If you need to make screen recordings to educate, train, or sell, there's no better tool than Camtasia from TechSmith.